What we have here is one of my favorite insects. It's a cicada, and unlike most of them, which are green, this one's brown, so it's got an interesting coloration on it, and we'll zoom in so you can see it better. So, only male cicadas make the singing sound because the females don't have sound producing structures. And these structures are called timbals, and it's basically a disc inside of uh, an exoskeleton case with muscles attached. And what it'll do is the muscles that it are attached to the disc will vibrate it and they use this sound as a mating call and although only the male cicadas have the sound producing structures both genders have sound detecting structures similar to ears and both the male and female can hear the mating call uh, that they're making so another interesting thing about these guys is that they have five eyes. They have the two big ones on the side, then in the middle of the head they have these three red dots, and these are called the dorsal ocelli. And they're not really used to see shapes, but they're more sensitive to light than the bigger eyes. And these probably help the cicada interpret the light orientation and that helps them with uh, flight stabilization and most flying insects will have a similar organ to this which is used to sense light from the horizon and which direction it's flying in and there's a cool adaptation that a desert dwelling cicada has and it's similar to human sweating so not this species but what a similar species will do is it feeds on tree sap and when it gets too hot it'll actually keep drinking tree sap until it starts coming out of the pores in its exoskeleton and of course that evaporates pretty much like sweat and it keeps them cool